Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the weekly review. A little bit later this time because there was maintenance and then the servers were just not available. You couldn't just log in. There were some kind of, I don't know, DD, uh, DOS attacks maybe. Something that's not related to the maintenance. But it feels really bad to take out the game for maintenance that should be like anyway. And then you can play for another few hours. So this is why I'm recording this uh, uh, at, at, at that point. And uh, there's not much to say, no news right now whatsoever for the next patch uh, or for the next season. And uh, we're just uh, waiting for something to happen, grinding some keys in the process. And speaking of keys, the week that's going to come is Fortified, Entangling and Bolstering. Now, uh, I actually have a whole new video released about Bolstering. Check the link in the description of this video if you want to watch it for more details. But some dungeons are going to be more unpleasant this week, especially with Fortified Bolstering. And maybe you need to adjust some of the routes to avoid some of the nasty mobs. As for Entangling, make sure you're picking the respective talent. So for Shaman, this is going to be Thunderous Paws. For uh, Paladin's Freedom, for Monk, it's Tiger's Lust, etc. The Priest has uh, improved fate. Um, this uh, just makes sure that you can move in some uh, situations where otherwise the Entangling could stun you. For example, if you're stalking the Orb on the last boss in Rise. Having said that, <coughs> we're going to go straight into uh, opening the vaults uh, this week. Um, I played mainly my Paladin, not in a healing spec, unfortunately. And then uh, I had one key on basically almost uh, everything else. So uh, opening the Shaman as an enhancement. Um, just because we get hands. We already have hands. So we're picking up this. And I already have four tokens, which is very nice. Uh, because now I can pick up a socket. Uh, in fact, I'm going to go do that <coughs> um, right now. I don't know if I have a good place to put it at. Uh, probably not. Maybe an enhancement gear. Yeah, I have socket on every place though. So the vault becomes more and more redundant at this point. Which means that it's uh, overdue time for a new season. Especially with no PTR and nothing interesting to do. Jumping on on the monk. Um, I think I run only one key on the monk as well. Actually, I run a couple because I was trying to adjust my UI. You probably noticed that my groups are now below my main buttons. I'm still working on it, but this is something that I'm trying to improve uh, for, for a while. And maybe I'll find the right recipe. Okay, uh, as you can see, the bars are now here and they look a little bit different. Opening is Mistweaver. Um, pff, I don't know what we need. Bracers. Uh, we get hands, which is going to be an upgrade at the end of the day. So I'm going to pick this up. And um, potentially turn them into tier because we have plenty of charges at this point. Uh, I'll just throw them right here so I know to do this uh, later. Other than that, I think there's uh, time walking available. So if you're interested in that, maybe uh, you can do something this week. I just uh, saw a message on the site, which means we're probably getting extended maintenances and scheduled maintenances this week. Uh, just contributes to a very bad game experience i wonder if the other games actually have something like that all the time maintenances that take down the servers and uh even if they do like i play a mobile game when they do a maintenance they give you back from the currency they're trying to sell right so i don't think that <laughs> happens in wow we don't get play time for this but yeah just a uh, grumpy old man here talking um the evoker gets a cloak I guess we can pick this up first because it has mastery and mastery is pretty good if you play augmentation and some of the keys actually played augmentation and uh, second it's mythic level um, also two tokens are not going to do any justice for me so uh, yeah just picking this up very minor upgrade um, I'm gonna put it right here the druid also has one key that I've run on uh, let's check this maintenance wednesday yeah just another maintenance this is this is beyond annoying like if we haven't played this game for for such a long time i i wouldn't think we could be able to 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 stomach that many maintenances i've also told this story quite a lot but my guild leader quit uh because of the maintenances because they were in the middle of our raid i should say my old guild leader because the guild fell apart after he left but yeah 
They just lost uh, about 20 players because of the maintenances, basically. Uh, the Druid needs ring, boots, neck, actually. And we get a trinket. And I don't want this trinket. Actually, I have this trinket. Yeah. Pretty useless. Pretty useless. Uh, we're not going to talk about this vault. Uh, this is like one of the tunes that actually could use upgrades from the vault, but no. Alright, let's see if I can switch servers, because this was the problem yesterday. By the way, if you're still watching, thank you very much for finding this video, because now I'm uploading these weekly reviews on my secondary channel. Um, the main channel, trying to keep it a little bit more cleaner, uh, with just guides and useful information. If you want, you can find the link to that in the description as well. And the Paladin is the... the character that I played most last week. I was basically learning to tank, trying to get some tank IO. Uh, playing some retribution keys. I don't even know if I spec holy last week at all. Um, so that's a thing. And uh, if you ask me what spec I'm going to open the vault at, I have no idea. I have no idea. We we actually pre have pretty good gear. We need a better ring, that's for sure. Um, but I think we have re retribution weapon. I'm just gonna open a stank, right? I I don't know why. It just feels like it. But I don't need Retribution Weapon. Trinkets are okay-ish. So maybe if I get a tanking weapon or something, that would be nice. Uh, we actually run some um, some uh, raid to fill our um, quest for, for the Helm Enchant. So that's a thing. Alright, we can pick up a shoulder upgrade. We can pick up a finger. There we go. Crit Mastery though. I need Mastery for my tanking gear. But I would like it to be a Heavy Mastery... Um, ring instead of this. However, this could be our biggest upgrade. Crit Mastery though, if it was Haste Mastery, uh, it doesn't have a socket. Uh, tough choice, but I think I'm gonna go with the ring because this is gonna be potentially just uh, 6 points uh, upgrade, 6 item level upgrade. This is bigger and it has stats that I basically need because my Mastery is quite low, which kind of sucks for tanking so yeah I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna pick this up uh and not worry too much about it um i am even going to if i find where this went uh i am even going to equip it over here and save it as my tanking set and we have to upgrade it later and yada yeah enchanted so on all right and now let me open my priest. I think I did four keys on my priest. Uh, it was not just one. So we potentially get two item uh, items in the vault for the priest. Which is going to be good. Because uh, the priest is probably the, the character with worst gear for some reason. I definitely played it more than my uh, evoker and my druid. But it's still behind. I guess this is how the game works. Like, the amount of uh, keys that you play is not relevant to your gear. Alright, opening his disc. Uh, I don't think that matters. Uh, why is our gear so bad? Because we need a chest and a bracers. And I think... Uh, wait, what? Not chest. I think it's something else that we needed. There we go. We need feet. We need feet. These have avoidance. They have haste. Uh, which ours do not. Crit is not so bad. Because I played the, the crit talent. Yeah, I think that's a very easy win here. Alright, so at least the last item on the list was uh, pretty, pretty good. And uh, the priest is getting some love. There we go. Alright, so thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, check my main channel for more content. And I will be uploading, of course, some runs uh, on this channel. Uh, if you're interested, check this out. Including some of the raid runs that I had uh, earlier. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, bye-bye, take care, and get out of here.